Maine Coon Cat vs. Siberian Cat What are the differences between the two cat breeds? These are two beautiful cat breeds. Most Maine Coons weigh 9 to 18 pounds, males are larger, and some tip the scales at 20 or more pounds. They don't reach their full size until they are 3 to 5 years old. Siberian cats typically weigh 8 to 17 pounds and sometimes more. The good-natured and affable Maine Coon adapts well to many lifestyles and personalities. They like being with people and have the habit of following them around, but they aren't needy. They're happy to receive attention when you direct it their way, but if you're busy, they're satisfied to just supervise your doings. Close a door on them and they will wait patiently for you to realize the error of your ways and let them in. They're not typically a lap cat, but they do like to be near you. They also retain their skill as a mouser. No rodents will be safe in a home where a Maine Coon resides. Even if you don't have any mice for them to chase, they'll keep their skills sharp by chasing toys and grabbing them with their big paws. A Maine Coon also enjoys playing fetch and will retrieve small balls, toys, or watered up pieces of paper. They can climb as well as any cat but usually prefer to stay on the ground level. That's where their work is, after all. They're also very smart and will happily learn tricks or play with puzzle toys that challenge their brain. The Siberian's heart is as warm as his homeland is cold. He loves people and wants to be near them, so expect this affectionate cat to follow you around, including to the bathroom, and to help you with all of your reading, TV viewing, and computer work. Sitting in your lap while you comb his fur may well be the highlight of his day. When you come home from work, he might not have a martini waiting, but he will be pleased to tell you all about his day in quiet, pleasant trills and chirps, interspersed with a few meows and purrs. Guests will find him to be a genial host, this is not typically a cat who is shy in the presence of strangers. Besides being loving and attentive, the Siberian is also active and playful. He will instigate games of fetch by bringing you a favorite toy to throw. Any item can become a plaything for this clever cat, so keep jewelry or other potentially intriguing items out of his sight. Teaching him tricks is a fun and easy way to challenge his agile brain. Both pedigreed cats and mixed breed cats have varying incidences of health problems that may be genetic in nature. Problems that may affect the main coons are Hip dysplasia which in severe cases can cause lameness. Hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, a form of heart disease that is inherited in Maine Coons. A DNA-based test is available to identify cats that carry one of the mutations that cause the disease. Polycystic kidney disease, a slowly progressive heritable kidney disease that can result in renal failure. Spinal muscular atrophy, a genetic disorder that affects skeletal muscles of the trunk and limbs. A test is available to identify carriers and affected kittens. Siberians are generally healthy, but one problem that has been seen in the breed is hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. Despite the length of the Maine Coon's coat, it has a silky texture that doesn't mat easily, if you groom it regularly. It is easily cared for with twice-weekly combing to remove dead hair and distribute skin oils. Useful grooming tools include a stainless steel comb for removing tangles to pull out dead undercoat, which is what causes tangles when it's not removed. Use it gently, especially in the stomach area and on the tail. Maine Coons are patient but they don't like having their hair pulled any more than you do. Bathe the main coon is needed, which can range from every few weeks to every few months if their coat feels greasy or their fur looks stringy. The Siberian's thick triple coat should be combed or brushed a couple of times a week to prevent tangles or mats. The coat will shed seasonally in the spring and fall, and you may need to groom more frequently during that time. A bath is rarely necessary, which is a good thing because the coat is highly water resistant. It can be difficult to get a Siberian wet enough to shampoo him. Brush their teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Trim the nails every couple of weeks. Wipe the corners of the eyes with a soft, damp cloth to remove any discharge. Use a separate area of the cloth for each eye so you don't run the risk of spreading any infection. Check their ears weekly. If they look dirty, wipe them out with a cotton ball or soft damp cloth moistened with a 50 to 50 mixture of cider vinegar and warm water. Avoid using cotton swabs, which can damage the interior of the ear. Keep the litter box spotlessly clean. Cats are very particular about bathroom hygiene, and a clean litter box will also help to keep the long coat clean. It's a good idea to keep them as an indoor-only cat to protect them from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by dogs or coyotes, and the other dangers that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by a car. Maine Coons and Siberians who go outdoors also run the risk of being stolen by someone who would like to have such a beautiful cat without paying for it. If possible, build your Maine Coon or Siberian a large outdoor enclosure where he can jump and climb safely. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. 
Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. A Maine Coon is a big, rugged cat with a smooth, shaggy coat who looks as if they could put in a full day mousing on a farm in all weather conditions. Indeed, they were built for just such work in the harsh Maine climate, and their breed standard reflects their heritage, calling for a medium-sized to large cat with a well-proportioned body that is muscular and broad-chested. A Maine Coon has substantial, medium-length legs and large, round paws, well tufted with fur to serve as snowshoes during winter. A heavy coat is shorter on the shoulders, longer on the stomach and breeches, long fur on the upper hind legs, with a rough in front and a long, furry tail waving a greeting. A medium width head is slightly longer than it is wide and has a squarish muzzle. Large, well tufted ears are wide at the base, tapering to a point, and large, expressive eyes are green, gold, greenish gold, or copper. White or bi colored Maine Coons may have blue or odd eyes. The Siberian is notable for having a long triple coat with guard hairs, the outer coat, on hairs, the middle part of the coat, and a downy undercoat. He has an abundant ruff around the neck, thick but slightly shorter hair on the shoulder blades and lower part of the chest, and thick fur on the belly and breeches, the upper hind legs. The undercoat thickens in cold weather. The coat comes in all colors and combinations of colors, with or without white. He looks powerful and alert but gazes out at the world with a sweet expression. His head is a modified wedge with rounded contours broad at the top and narrowing slightly at the muzzle. Medium large ears are well furnished with tufts of fur. The nearly round eyes can be green, gold, green gold, or copper. White Siberians or Siberians with white patches may have blue or odd eyes. Cats are obligate carnivores, which means that they rely on nutrients found only in animal products. Cats evolved as hunters that consume prey that contains high amounts of protein, moderate amounts of fat, and a minimal amount of carbohydrates, and their diet still requires these general proportions today. The friendly, laid-back Maine Coon is a perfect choice for families with children and cat-friendly dogs. They love the attention they receive from children who treat them politely and with respect, and they don't mind playing dress-up or going for a ride in a baby buggy. The Siberian has a bold temperament, and nothing much ruffles his composure. These characteristics make him an excellent choice for a family with kids. No nighttime monsters will get past the Siberian on guard at the foot of a child's bed. They are happy to live with other cats and cat-friendly dogs, too, as long as they recognize that he's in charge. Introduce pets slowly and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.